Ormond Abbey is a ruined medieval monastery a few miles from Shrewsbury in England. And it was founded in the early 12th century. The building closed its doors officially in 1539. And the buildings fell into disrepair. The church was largely destroyed. The site is now the care of English heritage. From an estate sponsored and visited by earls and kings, the estate fell into debt. Women of ill repute were frequent in the abbey and young boys were found in the dormitories. But is this place haunted? Join us as we investigate Ormond Abbey. That's it. Thank you so much. You know how to use it. What is up, everybody? We're back Hello. with another one. I'm not going to be messing about. You've just seen a bit of the history of the place. So what we're going to do is we're going to split up a bit, aren't we? Yeah. Um, not sure where yet, but Simon's going to be on the main cam. I'm going to be on the other cam, and uh, we're going to just try and break this place down a little bit. Put a bit of more light on it. So we're going to break this break this place down. There is a house nearby. So we've got to be careful and there are two individuals just over the other side of the fence don't know what they're doing uh don't know what they're doing i said to you it's probably a grinder date or something i don't know but um we're just gonna get to it you know what to do please smash that like button don't forget to consider subscribing if you're new and leave a comment below should we do it yeah man let's go how are we doing yep Hello, Lee. Hello, blinding Simon. I can't see you. <laughs> see you in a bit, mate. Right, so we're both going our own separate ways. <clears throat> going to have a look at what's up here. I'm not quite sure. Right, so the cloister looks pretty interesting. Gonna get ghost tube on the go. But this place is beautiful. Let's give you a bit more light. And it is pitch black now you can just see Simon there going into the for the building so to a certain extent I am going to take him around to have a little look but I'm trying to avoid where the house is is just over there house is so look at that hello there my name is Lee If there are any spirits here that like to come forward and try and communicate with me, you're very welcome to. Meaning you no harm and we come in peace. Is there any spirits here with me? Can you come forward, please? My name's Simon. night vision because you can't really see a lot. Standing. 
the gate here. The gate that leads upstairs, but it's locked. Hello? Any spirits up there? If there is anybody up them staircase, can you come forward? Maybe you could walk down the stairs. Maybe could you throw something, a piece of rock or something? Just to let us know that you're here. Speak. John. Your name's John, is it? So this over here would have been the kitchen. <coughs> would this be a fireplace maybe? It's a big ass fireplace. Oh yeah, it would be, look there's the chimney. This is one big ass fireplace though. I guess I'd have many stoves or something on here. I'll keep looking behind me because, oh, there we go. The massive fireplaces in this wall show that the building was a kitchen. And then what would have happened is the food would have been cooked here, prepared in this area and uh, taken through here. which is, would have been the refectory, refectory. It's where they would have all eaten. But we'll have a look at that in a minute. So I think what we'll do is, we'll get the ghost tube up on the go. Where are you, John? My name's Simon. Sorry guys camera turned off um, I had a couple of bits come through on ghost tube which obviously I didn't capture let me just uh, it said just read it back to you it said why are you here and then I was trying to sort the camera out and it said speak and then John and over here You still with me, John? Are you in here? Is anybody in here with me? Be careful when walking because can't actually see anything. There's some right good drops around here. So sorry if the quality's changed a little bit, but I'm you I'm actually filming through the app now. So apologies there everybody. The spirits, I'm holding a device in my hand that will allow you to communicate with us. Mother. Mother. Why am I here? I can't answer that spirit. Turn the volume down just a little bit because of the people nearby. I can't answer that spirit. Um, punished. Punished. 
you were punished. Well, and you were made to work in the kitchens. Your mother punished you. You were forced to work in the kitchen. It's so eerily quiet, guys. Should we leave the kitchen then, Spirit? Come out of the kitchen. Torturer. A torturer? But this was a place of God, a place of worship. Surely there was no torturer here. Why would there be a torturer in an abbey? Makes no sense. I might be wrong. Related. <coughs> okay. Well, that would go with mother, I suppose. Daughter. Mother, daughter, related. Okay, spirit. So was there a, a fa is there a family here? Now, what you need to realise is, guys, that I've done no research of the place, so the only research I do of the place... Living is... room. Frustrated. This thing's talking, man. So, while I had my camera mishap, Ghost Tube was saying quite a bit, and now it's not saying anything. Typical. Is there any spirits here? My name's Simon. You can come forward. I'm friendly. Why are you frustrated, spirit? But the only research I do is when I do the intros for these videos. We, we try and avoid any history. There's footsteps. Timothy. You alright, dude? The camera's doing some weird shit. Okay, let's turn this off. Okay, so I've got Simon back with me. Um, he's just from, so what's actually happened, mate? So, so I was up there one, I just had the normal headlights on. I was going into put the um, infrareds on. Yeah. And it just turned off. The camera just turned itself off. It turned itself off. What's it saying now? This is this is the second time. We'll get to that in a sec. Do you want to recover the data? Obviously, yes. Recovering my damaged data that was added. Oh, okay, whatever. And as soon as it turned itself off, Ghost Tube started speaking. Yeah. So I was trying to get it back on. It said, uh, it came up with, uh, what did it say? It said, uh, why are you here? And obviously I was just trying to mess with this. And then I didn't say anything, it went to speak. Are you joking? <laughs> and then it said John. Um, by the time I got it back on, it hasn't really said anything again. And then it was recording, and I was talking again up there, and it went into standby on its own. 
and then it turned itself off and turned back on and come into that recovery bit. What the smeg? Okay, we all should stick together then, I think. Hey, at least something's good up there. Well, I think we should go back up there then, if that's the bit that's affecting the equipment. We called an over there, nothing. I think Ghost Tube said, I said, is there anyone here with me? I'm by the altar and it said dog. <laughs> I thought it said god at first. Oh, oh shit, my god. that would have been nice. So it's here. Turned itself off twice here. Okay, well, let's fire it back up again. You're on night vision? There's something obviously clearly doesn't want. So, is there anyone here with me again? Is it you that was turning this device off? Is it John? In the meantime, well, Simon's out there. I'm going to put a little REM pod down here. A REM pod that doesn't work. What? Mate, the REM pod don't work. Seriously? No? Well, yeah, I am serious. It's nothing. This has come through demon. Okay, so I've just the lights on, but no one's home. Literally, not a sausage. Oh, no, it's just gone off. That's a f I, I, before every investigation, I put new batteries in everything. What's going on up here? So Simon's up there. So I'm just going to get a spare battery out of my bag. I'm recording because... You what? You're joking? Oh, for goodness sake. And none of the equipment is working. It's coming on and just swishing off. The um, recovery data thing again. So, it's recorded our intro. Data error. What the hell's what the smeg's going on? Is that. Is that all it recorded of the intro? No. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Okay, so that's fine. Where am I? The run pod's going. Uh, the K2, sorry. Thank you, Spirit. Where am I? Where are you? We are by the font. This is your footage, so it has actually recorded. I'll just show that on camera. 
right so it's just recorded some of simon's footage which you probably would have seen anyway guys but i just want to show you as well for the, everybody at home all you lovely guys and girls watching so we've got there's three hours of battery out battery left what's that say cupboard oh fuck it's a camera and we've got four hours ten minutes of um memory card so technically there's nothing wrong with the camera Well, this is never, I mean, it's turned itself off before, but not with that. Shit, to be fair, mate. What the hell was that? We heard it. Can you just keep that camera rolling as well? See if it happens to you. Okay, Spirit, did we hear you? Down. We just heard. Did you hear the tap? Yeah. Could we just tell where it's coming. I don't know if it's coming from up there. Room. Rope again. Yeah. So, Spirit, are you messing with our equipment? There's a, there's a black box here. Cable. Mate, that's spitting out words, isn't it? Cable. Okay, spirits. So you've made it perfectly clear. That you're around us. There are three pieces of equipment there. And Simon has put a cat ball over there. So, if it was you, we'd be affecting any of our equipment. Turning off the camera, maybe affecting it, trying to draw power from it, maybe. Can you come forward? I think it was a tractor. If we come forward. The green light is called a K2 meter. If you go near it, it will change colour. It will change to yellow, to change to orange and red. The red light you see. A black box with a red light. If you touch that, like this. That's new. Okay. That's it. Thank you so much. You know how to use it. Well done. Thank you. See, it didn't hurt you, did it? It's good, isn't it? It plays music. You think you can try and do it again? If you can. It's clever, isn't it? Thank you so much, you know how to use it. Well done. Thank you. See, it didn't hurt you, did it? Okay, Spirit, so we're going to be leaving now. Feel free to touch any of the equipment, have a play. Touch the green light, touch the red light like you did before. And uh, we'll see you in about, we'll leave you for about 15 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. Okay. 
interested to see if the camera turns off as well. I yeah. see you. I see you as well. I'd like to see you. So if you see us, you'll see us walking out. And we'll see you in a bit, hopefully. Feel free to show yourself on this on anywhere around here. Feel free to move any of the equipment. And uh, we're going to leave you here in this spirit. Statue, Terry. Father. Funny. Business is picking up because we're doing our, we're just literally having a break. You can see Sai's just having a fag. The ghost tube is going crazy. Going nuts. Yeah, yeah. You watch the camera. Turn on. Yeah, I know. So we've left the. You can't see, but we've left the camera just up there, and we're hearing footsteps. And we saw, can only describe on the side of the building, didn't we? A massive shadow. <coughs> I definitely 100% heard footsteps from over here. 100%. And you did, don't you? You did before me. You can't see anything, the camera's not. But honestly, guys, the spook levels have gone up to DEFCON 5. Mind you, one's the highest, isn't it? <coughs> DEFCON 1, that's the worst, yeah, isn't yeah. it? Okay, so we'll go DEFCON 1. Prisoner. Prisoner. 
Rest in peace. Happy. Prisoner. Murdered. What? Damage. Bless. How are you? But you see that wall up there, and you can't see it. But the wall there, that's where that wall just there, that's where the shadow was. Did you see that as well? Yeah. Okay, Spirit, coming back in. The red light's still on the camera, so it's still running. Well, Spirits, we're back. So you've got plenty here. That was from my phone. So there are plenty of pieces of equipment. Cat ball. There's a ramp pod over by the door of the entrance to this building. And Simon's holding a piece of equipment that you can talk directly into. Feel free to touch us, throw something, make a knock, a bang. Can you tell us what your name is, please, Spirit? Maybe you could walk through that door. Use the energy from that device by the door. Like you did before. That's silent in it. We are using the ghost tube box and internet's on. So we've got 4G, so. Yeah. Thank you, Spirit. We heard you knock. Think you could do it again, please. This is the Thank you. 
We heard the knock. Thank you. The, the, there was a bat in here, but that, it's been gone for a while, hasn't it? I haven't seen it. Yeah, the bat wouldn't make that knock. That no. Bat, a bat wouldn't knock into it. Yeah, that was. Spirit, the noise by the door that you were playing with earlier, with a metal stick, the black box with the red light. See if you can do it again for us by doing what you did before. Are you sinners? Are you sinners? I don't know. It sounded the last word could have been sinners. Oh, there is a name there. Oh yes, I agree. We, we haven't done it for a while. Do you want to do it? Back watch. <laughs> yeah, it is. Do you think that was a Didn't... It, I don't know. We've got to take into consideration now, haven't we? It could have been the bat landing. Church organ. That did. It could have been the bat landing, couldn't it? It betrayed you. Betrayed him. Befriend him. You want us to be friends with the bat? I mean, that, that noise could have been the bat landing on the roof. Yeah. And then... A complete. Complete. And then you're a, a complete most of the way. The thing is, that sounded like the same... Sounded like the same person speaking as well. Maybe it's like a sermon. Maybe. Spirit. Maybe if you could. I mean, I bet there was loads of singing that went on within these walls. Lots of prayer. Maybe you'd like to maybe bless us. Maybe sing us a psalm or pray for us. Would you mind doing that for us, please? Just let us know by touching that green light. It will flash a different colour. It won't hurt you. <clears throat> or doing what you did before by touching the red light that's on the floor by the entrance. If that was you, could you knock again for us, please, just to confirm it was definitely you that made that yes. noise? That did sound like that, didn't it? City Council. <laughs> the City Council. Trust me, they're useless. You guys could build roads better than our City Council could.
it was that tap. It was coming from the tomb room again. Like that knock. Yeah. Gear, gear 10 if you spend the night here. Yeah. Um, no. 10 quid? <laughs> no chance. £10.50? What about you? Oh, I'm washing me out. I'm busy that night. <laughs> <laughs> this is an amazing place. I don't feel too bad down here. It's, it's up there. Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay at the moment. I didn't early though when we were them footsteps. Yeah. What we could do is pack up our troubles and then take a slow walk down to that bit and finish off down there. See if now the footsteps will come forward. We'll get a bit closer to them. Yeah, may as well. Got to go back that way anyway. To exactly. Get to the car, so. Gonna pack up our shit and we'll see you in a minute. Cut. That's where we can hear things over there again. We do good, yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay guys, I just we are about to leave, but just wanna document this. We're just trying to debunk it, but we can't. There's a building over there, not sure if the camera can pick it up. But the tomb room that we've just come out of. And there's a shadow <coughs> going directly. I mean, whatever it is, it's big or it's near a light source. It must be, wasn't it? Because it was the f so it was ever it, it must have been close to the source of light. Yeah. And it went directly from left to right, across the wall of the building. And we're trying to debunk it, trying to work out why we've moved here, because there are some lights directly behind Simon uh, from um, a building over there. But it can't be from the house. Because the front, these shadows on the front face, the front, yeah. So, whatever the cause that shadow came from here behind me, yeah. And it was either big or it was close to a light source, but there are no light sources here. We're in pitch black darkness, so I can't, I can't explain that shadow at all. But it's happened twice, and I know you guys haven't seen it, we had the camera turned off. We're literally packing up our stuff and twice it's happened. I, I can't debunk it, so if anybody else does come here and sees the same thing, maybe you guys could help us with that. Let us know in the comments below. 